I just got a package and inside it is probably the most impressive wireless neckband I have seen in this budget. It's the new version of CoStar's mate band called LE01. I think it's codenamed as Champion. Okay, pretty big name. But yeah, you can see the highlight of the product on the package itself, 120 hours of playtime. That's different from the 120 hours of standby we saw with the original mate band. To give you an idea, the original mate band had a 130 milliamp hour battery. These have an 800 milliamp hour battery, so it's pretty big. And they've also employed something called hexa energy technology, I guess. So seemingly it makes the existing batteries last even longer. So that combined with the higher capacity should mean better battery life. So let's take a closer look. One of them is a red and black version and another is a black version. Let's unbox the red and black first. It comes with this kind of interesting looking pouch inside it, which is made of cardboard. CoStar keeps innovating with these cool friendly designs, you know, I like it. It's not the same plastic covered earphones that you see with every box, especially in this budget. Usually budget brands don't innovate that much so that's one of the things I like about these guys. They also have a type C cable in the box for charging this thing. It's pretty short but hey at least they have provided something. I guess you're supposed to tear open this thing but I'm just gonna slide the earphone from the top. It looks really pretty. I don't want to open it. And there it is red and black. The cables are red and the rest of the earphone is black. It's still the same lightweight material that I remember and it seems even more flexible than last time. Like I didn't remember the original mate band being this floppy. I mean, it's a good design, really. The earphones are supposed to be ultra flexible to be around your neck, right? And they have the magnetic ear tips as well, which can pause and play media. You may be surprised how many budget neck bands don't have that magnetic pause feature. Let's quickly take a look at the black version as well. It should be completely black. That might suit better for those who want a like a minimal aesthetic without any bright colors. There you go, two colors side by side, the red one and black one. Which one of these would you prefer? Let me know in the comments. Okay, let's quickly try these on and see how they sound. I mean, I do remember how the original mate band sounded and if you go back and watch the video, I was very impressed with the sound quality. So I'm expecting something along those lines, if not even better. While pairing, I noticed that it doesn't automatically go into pairing mode. You have to press and hold the power button and continuously hold it for another five seconds until it starts flashing, you know, blue and red. That's when you can pair it up. I mean, it does enter pairing mode after 30 seconds automatically, but you can trigger that yourself by pressing and holding that button. It's a one-time process anyway as you know and this has bluetooth 5.3 by the way so that's good that should mean lower latency lower energy consumption and better range that's another upgrade compared to the bluetooth 5.0 we had in the original mate band wearing them is pretty comfortable nothing really seems out of place but these like battery compartments are definitely slightly bulkier even though they are lightweight they are you know bigger in size mainly because of that larger uh, battery capacity that i mentioned the ear tips fit comfortably and snugly it doesn't pull down or anything like that Although I wish these buttons were a little bit easier to kind of navigate, like the indents on these buttons are not easy to feel. So when you're running your finger over them, it's not easy to identify if it's a volume up button, down button or the calling button. So I wish it was a little bit more easy to identify like the original mate band had. I loved the buttons on the first mate band. I mean, once you get used to it, it's fine. but. You know something i noticed from a usability standpoint and sound quality again is really good this time around i noticed it has even more stereo separation meaning that the sounds coming from the left sound even more to the left and likewise to the right so it has a much wider stereo separation or a stereo expansion as we call it i would have usually done it with an equalizer but this time around it's baked right in and i like it there is that bass boost button that they introduced this time around it's not a dedicated button you have to double press the call button by default it stays on but you can toggle it off and on by double pressing the call button each time. I recommend you keep it on because it sounds really good. I noticed it not only presses up the bass but brings up the mid range as well so the instruments and the human voice also sounds better. It works very well there is no issue in keeping it on so yeah there's no reason to turn it off leave it as it is. The sound quality again as I said is brilliant I have never heard anything as good in this price range. Again, it's comparable to the original mate band, which is not a bad thing. It was already sounding pretty good, but this time around, like I said, with more stereo separation. So yeah, it's a valid improvement. That combined with this new exceptional battery life makes this a worthy upgrade in my opinion. And in case you're wondering, yes, it is IPX5 rated, so it should resist your sweat just fine. The charging port is under this rubber cover on the right side, so you can plug it in and have it charged up. They say 10 minutes of charge can give you 10 hours of playback. Given the battery capacity, I think it's possible. While I was checking the price on Amazon, I noticed that the red and black version 
costs a little bit more than the pure black version. I wonder why. I usually haven't seen that much of a price gap between the two versions. So, you know, Costar, uh, maybe you could kind of bring those prices together so that one version doesn't kind of compete with another. Keep them somewhat neck and neck because these are both great earphones. Obviously, it's the same model, but the color alone shouldn't really make that much of a difference. This red and black version is my favorite, but if I was buying, I would probably stick with the black one because it's 200 rupees less for the same product. And I can't see the product when I'm wearing it anyway, so it wouldn't really matter. This thing offers you all the same great experiences that I had with the original Mate Band. You know, low latency for gaming, these magnetic buds that can pause and play media. It's all great. So that's what a good upgrade in my opinion should be. You know, if you're launching a second version, it should take all the good things from the first one and add even more features. And that's exactly what they have done. For a fractionally higher cost, they've added so many more great features. That 120 hour standby has turned into 120 hour playback. That's amazing. I mean, the price on the box is like $24.99. I would have paid that to be honest, because even in this price, I don't see a lot of good quality competitors, even if they have battery life charging everything. They don't have the same level of audio quality that I expect. CoStar is one of those few affordable companies that actually is making good quality stuff and hey that's exactly what i'm here to promote as a tech lover i want everyone to have good quality electronics for an affordable price and yes there is an exclusive discount for you as well just use this coupon code to get 10 percent off on amazon and 20 percent off their official website links will be in the description go take a look and yes i know you're probably thinking like what are you gonna do with two of those there will be a giveaway i haven't figured out exactly what i'm gonna do for this giveaway but mostly it will be held on our discord well if you've seen me adding a few bots to our discord that's why i'll probably be picking the most active person on discord and i'll just give them one of these i think i'll keep this red and black version this time last time around i gave away both maybe this time i'll give away this black version and maybe something else you know i'll have another prize i'll make an update video on that don't worry watch out for a giveaway video soon and join our discord and start being active if you like to win something in the future not just this but yeah in the meanwhile let me know what you think of the the Mate Band LE01. I'm actually pretty impressed. It has everything you could possibly imagine in a neck band, but at a super affordable cost. And that battery really doesn't feel that much heavy than the original version, even though it has significantly bigger capacity. So again, well done, CoStar. You know, I'm pretty happy with your new products. Do you want me to do more giveaways? I don't know. Let me know. Leave a like on this video and I'll try to do more.